when I first seen it, I was a little bit taken aback because as a woman, as somebody who knows uh, victims of spiking, um, it doesn't entirely seem believable in a sense. And then that's not to say that anybody's lying. That's to say that as a woman, these experiences are very real. They happen a lot. Um, and to see or to hear that that is not perhaps the case so far, um, it doesn't seem doesn't seem realistic. There needs to be more in place to make people feel comfortable coming forward with their experiences, whether that's the job of people like myself and, and, and these sorts of uh, organisations, whether that's the role of the police, um, whether that's the role of the council or the government, that is to, to totally be discovered. But I think the first step is to believe people when they say that this has happened and to remember that time and time and again, you know, just because there's no evidence does absolutely not mean that it hasn't happened.